This is a video about EndoNet, a breast cancer study run by the University of Oxford across 50 NHS hospitals. We appreciate you taking the time to view this information, especially when you are taking on lots of new information about the next steps of your medical journey. You are invited to take part because you have early ER positive breast cancer and have gone through the menopause. The recommended treatment on the NHS is a combination of surgery and endocrine therapy. Some women may also need radiotherapy. ER positive tumors rely on estrogen to grow and survive. Endocrine therapy stops the body making estrogen. This starves the tumor of this hormone which can cause it to shrink. Giving endocrine therapy before surgery is very effective at reducing the size of ER-positive tumors. This may mean less breast tissue needs to be removed at surgery. We don't know what impact this has on the type of surgery required and people's well-being. The EndoNet study compares two NHS treatment pathways. Both pathways are safe and effective for treating breast cancer, but it's not clear which is best. Everyone in the study starts endocrine therapy immediately and continues it after surgery for a total of 5 to 10 years. There are two treatment groups. The only difference between them is that group 2 has a 6-month tumour shrinking phase using endocrine therapy before surgery. If you choose to join, you will be placed into one of the groups at random by the study. Everyone will be followed up by their clinical and research team and complete health and well-being questionnaires. We are comparing people's well-being and the types of surgery in the two groups during 15 months of follow-up. If you are in group two, you will be closely monitored for the first six months before surgery. We will offer extra appointments and scans to monitor you closely and as reassurance during this phase. If you are not responding to the treatment, your surgery can be scheduled early. We have created an information leaflet to help you understand the study. You should discuss it with your doctor, family and friends. There is also information on our website. Taking part is voluntary and you can also leave the study at any time without it affecting your care. In summary, if you agree to take part, you will have the recommended treatments of endocrine therapy and surgery. You will be placed into one of two groups. The only difference is that group two has a tumor shrinking phase using endocrine therapy before surgery. You will also receive any additional treatments you need, such as radiotherapy or chemotherapy. By taking part, you will help give the NHS the evidence it needs to improve the way ER-positive breast cancers are treated. By joining other women on the study, you can help improve cancer care for everyone. Thank you for considering EndoNet. We know that you have received a lot of information in the last few days, and we appreciate your time at this difficult moment. We are here to support you on your medical journey.